What's up you guys, it's Mopey. Today I am going to be showing you guys my shoe collection. I'm gonna start out with the shoe collection and then we'll move back towards the hoodies in the closet. Now let's just get started. I'm, I'm not gonna bore you guys taking too long to talk about any shoe in particular. So um, over here, these are my basketball shoes. These are most of them. I'm not the biggest fan of basketball shoes, like knowing the ins and outs and what's heat or not. I know that um, these are rare, these are pretty cool and I feel bad wearing them because usually when I wear these I have the nicest shoes on the court, but I'm usually the worst out there, so I just kind of look silly. Can I say a side note? What? Guys, when I didn't have basketball shoes, Tyler was nice enough to let me wear these. Do you remember do, that? I do, yeah. And these are, those are really, I think those are pretty rare. Yeah. Like, like special. I saw in the comments when I was wearing them, kids would get mad. Kids were mad at you? Yeah. Like, you don't yeah. even know what you're wearing <laughs> yeah. right now? Yeah. You know, I'm a KD fan, guys. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah, not too much else to talk about with the basketball shoes. I like the LeBrons. Used to wear these a lot in videos. How do you feel about the new Curries? These Curries are okay. Just okay. A little bit stiff and not the comfiest. Yeah, so that's really it for the basketball shoes. Some other random shoes over here. These were sent to me from Jordan, so. Both those are sent to me, very kind of them. Oh, these, these are a flex. You don't even know. Off Yeezys right here. Look at these, that's what I call them. They're they're really fake Yeezys from Thailand. Now these are flex because um, where have you seen these before? Yeah, they're fake, so what? They're, they're sick. Thailand drip. Let's actually you'll get, never, a, let's get a closer you'll, look. You'll never them. actually catch me in a pair of normal Yeezys, but I did buy these for the memes, so that's why I have them. And these I'm, are the only Tyler, Yeezys. I'm not gonna lie, those are decent fake Yeezys. They're pretty good. They yeah. they were they were $60. 60 dollars in American money, and that's that's a lot it to spend in Thailand on fake Yeezys, but I just had to I had to get them for the memes. Got some Bapestas right here. Uh, these I bought used. They looked way better in the picture. The dude scammed me. I tried to return them saying the dude took bad pictures and I couldn't see this, but the lady said, nope, you gotta keep them. Let's see it. All, it's all the way around, all the way around. So I'm just gonna beat these up. I'm gonna tear these apart because they're already destroyed. Like they're just, ah. Anyways, I got some more Bapestas right here. Um, these were, so, okay, I put out a video customizing these. Original color, color I painted them. I like the white better than the all black. What do you guys think though? Leave a comment. Did I mess these up or did I make them better? I think I made them better. We will, we will see what you guys think though. I like the tongue too and like, yeah. All right, moving on to the shoe rack over here. We're gonna start down at the bottom. We got some Gucci slides, some Nike slides. The Tyler Creator, uh, I forget the name, I forget the name. Look at all this toe room. My toe ends right here. Bad. So they're like slippers. I like them though. In the corner, old, old Kobe's that I used to play basketball in. Got some Bape snowboarding shoes. I'm pretty sure that's what these are. I don't know why I got these, to be honest. Not much to talk about over there. Really not much. Shoes gifted to me from my brother. I actually love these a lot, even though I don't wear them too much. They're sick. Uh, count how many vans you have. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip past these. Let's get on to the vans. How many vans do I have? Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, 17, 18. 18 pairs of Vans. As you guys could tell, I am I love Vans. I'm a Vans guy. I'm starting to get into Air Forces more, but let me talk about my Vans for a second. Velcro Vans, very underrated. We got the Yacht Club ones right here. Don't really wear, this is, okay, so I guess I'm kind of a, a hype beast, a Vans hype beast or whatever, because I have a lot of Vans that I don't even really wear. I just got them for the collection, so. Wait, what are Yacht Club? Is that little Yachty or something? No, it's just like the name of it, like the colorway, I guess. Mm -hmm. Some more, same colorway, pretty cool. Not much to talk about here, just red and blue Vans. Um, he blood in and Crippin, though? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, all right, moving up. We got some cooler stuff over here. Shark Week Vans. I like these. I think I've worn these once. I need to wear my, my Vans more, honestly. Next, we I destroyed these uh, Mickey Mouse Vans. Got me inside, I got the hand, all that, you know? Oh, I know you had a crazy night wearing those. Why do you say that? And those were Santa Barbara Vans. Oh. <laughs> team team Pata Vans collab, pretty clean. Very sad story here, we have the Buzz Lightyear Vans and also the uh, Woody ones. I destroyed these, yeah, I messed them up so happened? bad. Dude, I had them in my car from when we thought there was gonna be a fire and we would like have to leave, there was a chair in my car that leaked this, oh, whatever this is, this this mud, whatever the hell, it leaked it on the shoes, like both are not looking good. Super sad. Also, really cool about these, it says Andy on the bottom. We got Supreme Vans right here. I threw on the off-white laces, you know, 
just because Supreme Off-White, why not? Looks cool, I guess. And it matches. It matches the, the text on the side. Now, I have, a, I have a question. Yes. As a viewer. Yes. You like low top or high top vans? I like low top better because high tops make me look shorter. It's just a fact. It's just high tops do make you look shorter. So. Now, here, wait. Pull out every different style of van you have. Which is my favorite style of these, you're asking? Yeah. Uh... These are the authentic. Yeah, I like these better than the Aero ones. These are the Aero vans. Yeah, these are the authentic ones. I like the stripe down the side. But are those like your top two, probably? Yeah, the high tops. Well, actually, shit. The deconstructed. So it was rumored Ooh. that um, I beat these up so, so hard. If there was an off-white Vans collab, this is what they would look like. I think these are pretty hype regardless of not actually having the title of off-white. I love so these so wh much. What one does that go under? That goes under, these, that looks like a are, mixture of the, these two. Uh, these like ones with, here. Oh, slide, okay. Yeah, deconstructed. Well, I mean like, kind of. Slide really, shape, yeah. Yeah, it's really weird, but still cool. This right here is all deconstructed vans. Uh, I think I'm missing like one of the colorways, but we got these ones, the marshmallow ones, slip on deconstructed ones. Like these aren't even, these are fake laces. Like they don't do anything. Oh dang. Yeah, so, and then the black ones too. Oh, I didn't even talk about the NAS ones. Dude, I got these for a really good price and they shot up in, in value, whatever, of, like recently, I think, I don't know, but very cool. I don't have the Fear of God vans. I could get them. I feel like they're not they're not overrated. It's just I don't need them. I don't need to spend that much money on those. I would like the Garçons without red laces. SpongeBob vans, pretty cool. Uh, these are my favorite basketball shoes that I have. These are the Kobe Pro Tros, um, undefeated collab. Not gonna be able to find these again unless you pay a lot of money. So I'm gonna keep these in good condition. I thought these were actually soccer cleats at first when I bought them. They're not, they're football cleats, but I still keep them around because they're cool to me. Just go know. to Europe. First pair of Jordans I got, the uh, Shadows. I don't really ever wear these, but you know, still nice. Look at that, look at how disgusting that is. That's just bad, that's mm -hmm. not cool. All right, moving along to the Air Forces. I have just recently got into the Air Forces and um, I need to say this right off the bat, I do not own an all white pair of Air Forces. That's, I don't even have the staple of Air Forces in, in my collection, so I can't even call it anything. Like, I'm just, I'm just a, I'm just a humiliation. I'm sorry, but I'll show you guys what I got. Uh, you know why I don't have all white Air Forces? Cause I like these. These are close enough to all white, but I still should have a pair. Got these sent to me from Champs, I wanna say. Uh, moving along, we have these Air Forces. These are the first ones I got and I wear these all the time. I love these. Got these ones recently. Don't really know uh, what the collab is. I forget, but um, you know, it's got some got some flowers design on it. Maybe a little bit girly, but I'll still wear them. I like them. And then we got the PlayStation Air Forces. Had my eye on these for a while and I just decided to get them recently. And if you feel that, you get a little perspective, like. Oh, she's it's, it's very, it's, it sticks out a bit, you know, it's kind of, Kind of odd, but it's just, it's really cool. I'm not um, it. Yeah, super, super clean. The uh, Off-White Air Forces, the MCAs. You know, I went sneaker shopping with cash, had to go crazy, I did. I think I paid like maybe 400 more than I should have, 500 more, now that the price has gone down a bit. I don't even know what to say really, just super happy I got these. These shoes I'm gonna be proud of for a while that like I worked hard and saved up some money and I'm happy I got these and I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep them clean and uh, try to wear them out when I can, so they just don't collect dust on my on my shoe rack. Yeah, you better wear those. I'm gonna try to. Crazy. And now we are going on to the customs. I have a few customs. I will put up the guys' Instagram right here that we created these all. AZ restorations for these ones. Mopi Vans painted super clean inside. Even got the Mopi on the inside. Yeah, don't really know how we did that, but these are super cool. Same guy that made these as well. These are the uh, Rick and Morty. High top vans, I don't even, like, the gradient, the artwork, pretty ridiculous. Mopey and the other one, wait, hold on, hold on. One of one, feeling special. Look at the art on these. Gradient, super cool. I don't really wear these out too much, you know, because I don't want to mess them up. I, I like these a lot. First custom vans I got. Oh, I guess I have one more pair, of, or a few more pairs of vans that I've left out, but, uh, Custom cartoonish looking vans. If you guys want to get some custom shoes, hit up these guys on Instagram. Awesome stuff. You guys can see it right here. If you guys remember the Krispy Kreme kind of trend I had going on my channel for a little bit. Mop Gang, Krispy Kreme. Pretty clean. Don't really wear these out, you know, a bit, a bit much, but beautiful in the collection. I think that's pretty much it for the shoes. 
Should I give my favorite? Yeah, give us give us a top three Moki shoes. Okay. Actually, four because we already know those are in there. Supreme, Supreme Vans. I think that's it. I think that's it right there. One, two, three, four. Well, that is my shoe collection. You guys want to come see my hoodies? I got a lot. I'll try not to bore you talking about them, but let's take a look. All right, on to the hoodie collection. Just do a quick pan over of the whole thing. I counted earlier, and I want to say there are 60 hoodies here, I think. I think, yeah, there's about 50 or 60. I have been acquiring these for like 10 years now. The oldest one, I'll get into it later. I'll get into it later, but I have been collecting hoodies for a long time. It's kind of ridiculous to have this many hoodies in California because it really does not get that cold, but I still try to wear them out when I can, and I love hoodies, so let's get into it. I'm not going to bore you guys and talk about them for too long, so I might just show them off real quick. I have a question. In middle school, did you strictly wear hoodies? In middle school, I wore... Uh, I want to say... Yeah, you this did! Hoodie a lot. You did. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Where is it? And then that is funny, guys. Mopey's not exaggerating. And then this one too. He would yes. Yeah. <laughs> that's 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 a uh, late middle school. This yeah. is. I was just rocking this like every day, yeah. not caring at all. I'm gonna grab him off here. And I'm gonna lay him down on the ground just to get through him super quick. Okay. okay. Bum hoodie, not special. Under Armour, meh. NASA hoodie given to me by Zach. It's pretty cool. Uh, skeleton hoodie, not sure where I got it from. Oh, that's Halloween, fine. Halloween vibes, yeah. Lakers, Express hoodie, you know, basic stuff. Omen hoodie for a brand deal. Very old, I rock that a lot. Nike windbreaker, super comfy. Little old no jumper hoodie. Plain guess gray hoodie. Oh, that's fire. It's got a little, it's hard to see, but it's got a little, yeah, I, I, it's got a little something, something on it. Uh, hoodie that was given to me in the Secret Santa from Zach. It is Lulu. Probably the, one of the comfiest hoodies I own. I think this is like a one of one random hoodie that a guy made that I bought. Um, well, it's a zip up, but it's like glow in the dark. It's cool. You know, I like the color. This is from a video. This is just, it's just here. I'm not just, it's, it's cause it's hot topic. I love hot topic. Basic Nike hoodie. My jacket. Random hoodie, whatever that is. Deadline. Stay away, I'm edgy, cat's hoodie. This is the YouTubers merch. OG, original, bucket squad. That's a flex. Old two I hoodie, not many people have that probably. Oh god. Uh, Nelk, pretty clean. Uh, FaZe champion hoodie. I think this was the first FaZe uh, champion collab that they put out. I like that one a lot. Super old Mopey merch. This is my first hoodie that I put out. God, look at the pile. It's getting crazy. <laughs> uh, another old two I hoodie. Very cool, just clean. Bucket Squad Windbreaker, awesome. I love this thing so much. Like, it's super, super nice. I don't know why I have two, but more two hype merch. Another one of Jesse's fire, fire um, pieces that he put out, the space, the space hoodie. It's all the colors and everything. Super clean. The H3, uh, they have some good merch. It's clean, it's cool. Oh, the Jidel, look at that. Dude, somehow I ended up with them. two of them. You had two? You stole Todd's. So I did, how. but I don't know how I got the other one. Super funny. Dude, these are the best hoodies ever. <laughs> uh, and then Cash's Fax hoodie, Halloween edition, I want to say, yeah. Now we're moving on to the heat. This is the real fire over here, and then we're going to start off by getting into it over here. All right. Uh, laser beams hoodie. It's so small. This is a medium. It looks like it's tiny. Like, I don't know what to do about that, but it's still cool. Uh, you know, I'm a, I'm a fan of Bexy. I like his music. I found him from Peep. I have three hoodies. I have a thing where I like buying multiple colors of a hoodie if I like it. This is the Night Slayer hoodie from him. And another one right here. Trippy Red's merch. 14, uh, 14. Yeah, this is okay. This is, you'll see what I have coming up later. But this, this Trippy Red merch is just okay to me. Just kind of a random dude that makes hoodies. I like this color. This is my favorite of your cool, hoodies. Cool design. This one's your favorite? Yeah. <laughs> it's a really cool design and color. I, I like that one a lot, actually. We got the Igor. Hoodie, not really Eagle hoodie. I just bought this off eBay and then I put this little pin on it because I think it fits well with that. It does. Oh, bait, Jurassic hoodie. Pretty cool. Don't you have one like it too? Mm hmm. Got the camo. Speaking of camo, we got bait hoodie. This is my first bait hoodie that I got. I got one more to show you guys later. Um, ooh, this hoodie. I wear this all the time. This is my Powerless hoodie. The comfort on this one, it's got the zippers on the side pockets. Very. Very underrated. I love this so much. Not a lot of hoodies have them. This one was given to me from Jesse. Nice Zara hoodie. Check out camo pattern on the inside. Really comfy. I probably say all these hoodies are just super cool, comfy, and clean, but like 
I just love my hoodies. That's how I feel about all of them, honestly. Oh, whoa. This is, uh, Six put out his first merch. This is Logic's producer, for those of you that don't know. And, uh, yeah, it's a really cool design. I like it. When did you get that? Actually, just, like, a few days ago. Nice. Yeah. Okay, we got some heat right here. We got some heat. Or at least I like to think so. The guys kind of roast me for, you might know, Patricia Ray. It's my favorite brand. But we got this one. Another color of this way. And then I'm going to skip to this one. This is my favorite. This is like the original colorway that he put out of this hoodie. It's all handmade, like super high quality. Love the colors. Other brands try to copy him. He's onto something. And um, like, look at this. This is, this is sweet. Um, I'm a weirdo. I'm a real big weirdo. And I like buying different colors of the I exact like, same hoodie. I like these Patricia Rays. You like these ones a lot? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have the thing that goes across the side and it goes across the top too. I like that a lot. Don't know how you do that. Jeez, this this tower is ridiculous. <laughs> oh my god. I can't okay, I'm not gonna stack up these ones because these ones are too nice, but let's get into the heat. Alright, custom what the? custom uh Louis Vuitton patch hoodie Instagram right here. Dude who makes it. Very cool. When did you get that? Just been just been collecting the hoodies over the past. I've never months seen that. Yeah. That is amazing. Yo, send me this, the link to this man. Yeah. Instagram for this right here. Check it out. Ah, I forget where I got it from, but this one was expensive. This was like two hundred something. Look at these skeleton or look at the skulls on it. You went to the back of Hot Topic for this one? No, I did not go to Hot Topic. Um we got the XXX hoodie right here. Sad and it got eyes on the back. Peep hoodie right here. This isn't too rare or special, I don't think, but you know, I like the peep stuff. Scary looking, got these spikes around the outside. This brand is crazy though, really high quality. I don't know how to behave, whatever that means, but I love this hoodie. This is it. Yeah, this one I love a lot. It's a fire, just babe hoodie, like I don't know what else to say. Brutally fire. And then this, okay, so this is probably my oldest hoodie that I have. I was wearing this thing around in elementary school, and this thing is so crazy because it was ahead of its time. This was like the first, this was like the first full zip hoodie that was like, I'm not going to say around, but like. Bape took their whole entire idea this, off of this Volcom hoodie. Off this one right here, is that what you're saying? Yeah. <laughs> this, no, this was seriously in like 2003 or five yeah. or something like that. So, I mean, if you take a look, like. I don't know, it's see-through also. So um yeah, this thing is crazy. This is vintage. I'm 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 keeping this thing forever. Pass it down to my kid so he can run around like an idiot with Damn, this. Damn, he's gonna glue. start off elementary school dripping. <laughs> my probably my favorite hoodie of the collection is the Lil Peep Sus Boy collab hoodie. I waited in LA. I got up at like five in the morning, waited, was second in line at this like pop-up shop got this there wasn't very many and yeah like i just i love this hoodie so much i can't wear it out though if i got a stain on this thing i'd be so sad like i don't know what to do just to, just appreciate it i guess and then what i think is the hardest flex of my entire collection right here now let me let me know down below if i'm tripping but this is trippy red's very first merch drop like ever this the first thing that he put out clothing wise i got all three of the colors and yeah you know i just knew that trippy was going to be a star so i had to get all three and find me someone that has all three colors and uh i don't think you're going to be able to like these are these are rare these are rare i got all three i'm happy about it that is pretty much it for everything my hoodies my shoes i hope you guys enjoyed yeah this is this is a re this is, i have an i have do i have a problem is this an uh, maybe I'll chill on buying hoodies, but yeah, this is my collection, you guys. I hope no, don't chill. Keep buying them. Keep up the collection. All right, I'll keep it up. Who has a better hoodie collection than me? Not just expensive stuff, you know, rare stuff too. I want to see it. I got to work on my shoe game some more. Leave a comment down below what shoes you guys thought were the coolest and what hoodie you guys thought was the coolest. Hope everyone is having a good holiday times. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. And I think that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching and Mopey out. Sometimes I wish I never met.